a New York-based attorney whose firm filed a lawsuit against commercial aircraft manufacturing giant Boeing earlier this year, was met with a surprise outside his home in late April. The lawyer, who is said to live in the New York City borough of Queens, says he found the missing emergency slide that detached and fell from a Delta Airlines 767-300ER on Friday, April 26th. Indeed, the 767 was operating as flight DL-520 from New York's John F. Kennedy International Airport to LAX when the incident occurred. The plane took off over Jamaica Bay, and officials had searched the waters for the missing slide for several days. According to the New York Post, attorney Jake Bissell Linsk discovered the slide at around noon on Sunday, April 28th. The slide was situated on rocks just a few feet away from his front yard. We're right on the beach, and I saw it was sitting on the breakers. Bissell Linsk's home faces the Atlantic Ocean in the small residential neighborhood of Bell Harbor. According to media, the slide's exact location was right off Beach 129th Street and Beach 130th Street on the south shore of the Rockaway Peninsula. Located about 6 miles southeast of JFK, the slide appeared to journey farther than officials expected. The lawyer said he went outside to examine the deflated yellow slide more closely and snap pictures. He noted that it seemed to be still intact, albeit tangled in the rocks and floating in the water. After the surprising discovery, Bissell Linsk's neighbor alerted officials. My neighbor called the FAA hotline and they're closed on Sundays, the attorney explained. Later that evening, some Delta crew members arrived at the scene to retrieve the slide. According to Bissell Linsk, they placed it in the back of the pickup truck and hauled it away. I see this Delta truck pull up and watch them pull it out of the water, he said. It took them about 10 minutes. Bissell Linsk is a partner at the Labaton Keller Sukuro Law Firm. On January 30th, the group sued Boeing in a Virginia federal court, alleging the manufacturer made false and misleading statements about safety in the wake of the Alaska Airlines 737 MAX 9 door plug blowout on January 5th. Our case is all about safety issues at Boeing, and this slide is literally right in front of my house, Bissell Linsk explained. The law firm also represents a group who purchased Boeing stock between October 2019 and January 2024. Bissell Linsk said that the law firm has not decided if the slide is relevant to their safety lawsuit. However, the attorney believes the slide should be sent to the appropriate investigators, saying, I didn't want to touch it, but I got close enough to get a close look at it. I think the slide should be handed over to whoever is investigating the incident. So, what do you think of this peculiar coincidence? Let us know by leaving a comment. In addition to our daily YouTube videos, Simple Flying publishes over 150 articles every week. If you're looking for the latest aviation news and insights, visit simpleflying.com.